If you guys are looking for some cheap, fast and reliable coins, make sure to check out MMOGAH, link is at the top of the description. These guys have been around for years, they're 100% safe and reliable and make sure to use my code FIFAXPENSE for 3% off your order at the checkout. Oh, what is going on guys, it is FIFA Expense here and welcome back to another video on the channel. Now today's video is going to be me showing you guys why this new SBC is potentially a scam and why you guys should not do it. So before I get into this video guys, we have got a huge 200 50,000 coin giveaway on Instagram and if you guys can see we're almost at 14,000 subscribers when we hit that we're going to give away the 2.2k FIFA points and the 250,000 coins link is in the description and the pinned comment for the Instagram giveaway go over go like it follow the Instagram can we get 100 likes on this video and if you are new make sure to subscribe but let's get straight on into it so I'm going to be giving you guys the pros and the cons of this new Marcus Rashford SPC so the pros of this SPC is it's Marcus Rashford. He's a good player. If you look at his stats right here on the right-hand side, what's he got? No, bottom left, sorry. He's got 96 pace, 88 shot, 80, 83 passing, 88 dribbling, 82 physical. Now, I don't know what his work or anything like that is. I'm not going to complete the card, and I'm not going to go into too much detail about it. Now, if I open up Footbin right here, if I go into Active Challenges, this Marcus Rashford is about 450,000 coins on uh, PS4 and about 500k on Xbox. So if you guys wanted to go ahead and submit this, I'm sure a lot of you guys at this stage in FIFA have done squad battles. You've got a lot of untradeable, so I reckon it costs about 400,000 coins to buy the extra place, maybe a bit less. Now, if you are going to complete this SBC, please wait until the weekend. This SBC, okay, has 13 days remaining. I understand you want to use this card for weekend league if you want to get him, but he's got 13 days left. The price when an SBC comes out is always at an all-time high because everyone's the, the traders like me the investors like run the foot market what they do is they sell their players off today but then slowly but surely the market of like the informs that are 40k slowly go down to 30 20k and this SBC in about 13 days time I reckon it'd be about 320,000 coins 300k be a lot less now the reason why I'm saying wait the big reason is because there is a Chinese promo coming out very 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 soon and right now the market is that the biggest market rise I've ever seen in FIFA. On PS4, players like Outerworld has gone from 10,000 coins all the way up to like 25,000 coins. The market is at an all-time high, and I would honestly wait because I think the market is it's too high to want to do an SBC like this. It's too high, and honestly, if you want to do this SBC, just give it a couple of days. If the promo doesn't come out tonight at Friday at 6 p.m., so in like 10 minutes' time if you're watching this, do it potentially if you want to do it at your own risk, if you just want the card for your weekend league. If it does come out, then the market is going to drop and it's going to be happy days. That's what happens when a promo comes out. And the market the past week or two has only been rising. The foot headliner didn't really make a decline in the market. And this promo is quite big, so it's going to uh, make the market drop. Now, the last pro, and I want to say about this, this squad building challenge, this player of the month for Ashford, is if I go on this thing right here. So if we're completing the England, you get a 50k pack. That's pretty good. 50k pack, you can get some good. Next pack, a rare election players pack. I think that's a 35 or a 45k pack. It's That's, in my eyes, is quite decent. That's six rare gold, six rare silvers, I believe. And I'll be honest with you, I've seen a lot of big players. So this alone is like 80,000 coins and worth of packs. Then you get down to the Red Devils. This is a 100,000 coin pack. And then this right here is a rare, rare mega pack. So that's a 55k pack. So that's 150, 200. That's about 230,000 coins in packs right there. And potentially, if you were going to buy these, like if you're a pack addict like Castro, that's 230,000 coins right there in packs you're going to be getting back. So if you do buy packs a lot, you're getting 230k worth of packs. This SBC is about 450k. So that's costing you 220k if you would just buy packs if you're an addict. So you can get, these, you can get this card for 220k and all the pack rewards if you were just to buy packs, if that makes sense. Now I'm going to go to the main reason why I would not do this SBC. And this is my reason. This is why a lot of you guys clicked on this. Look at the stats, okay? Remember these stats. I've got them on screen, but just keep a good look at these stats, okay? Marcus Rashford. Let me now go Marcus Rashford a second. Marcus Rashford, you know, this player of the month is really good. Does Marcus Rashford have any other special cards? That's what I'm wondering. Does he have any other special cards? Let's just have a little look. Marcus Rashford. Oh my god. Okay, so he's got some inform. So you can see he's got player of the month. Player of the month means he's he's playing very well right now. He's going to be getting some inform. He's going to be getting some team of the weeks. He's going to be potentially getting a high rate card. Has he got any other special cards other than these ones right here? By the looks of things, it doesn't look like it. But wait. Just wait. Just wait. That's my phone. Um, I'm panicking right here. I'm panicking. I'm panicking. 200 likes. <coughs> Here we go, let's cut this out. Let's just go up a little bit. Let's uh, have some fun, you know. Let's just go up and see if he's got any other special cards, potentially. Let's go up one more time, one more time, you little bitch. Come on, come on, where are you two? Where are you two, bro? 
Come on. Where are you? I know you're here. I know you're around here somewhere. I know you're here somewhere, mate. Don't hide. Don't hide from me. I know you're somewhere here. Where is this guy? Am I being dumb? Wait a second. I swear, I'm pretty sure this guy has a headliner card. Where is this guy's headliner card? Give me one second. Um, Rashford. Rashford headliner. How much is he going for? He's going for 500k on the PS4. So why can't I find him? Why can't I find Rashford headliner? There we go. Why can't I find him for special? I don't know what's just happened there. But okay, so remember, that SVC right now is 500k on Xbox. And it's 450k on PlayStation. Okay, do you remember the stats? Okay, so Play the Month has 80, 96 pace. This card, 95. Play of the Month, 88 shot. This card, 86. It's got Play of the Month, 83 passing. This card, 81 passing. Play of the Month, 88 dribbling. This card, 78, 87 dribbling. Play of the Month, 82 physical. This card, 80 physical. Now, I know what you're thinking, Eggy. What's your point? Okay, this card right here is tradable. Toreadable. If you don't like your rash for player of the month, you are stuck with him. That is 500k gone. This guy right here, 500k, bang. Okay, 500k. But he's tradable. And look at this, he's a headliner. If you don't know what headliner means, it means every single time Rashford gets an inform, this card is going to go one above his player of the month. So if Rashford gets one more inform, one more inform in the rest of FIFA, this card right here is going to be worth, he's going to have better stats than his player of the month. That is, that is it. It's going to have better stats than his player of the month. I know what you're thinking. Jesus, Eggy, thank you for this. You just saved me 400k. Boys, not only that, but this is an investment. Imagine if Rashford gets an inform in three weeks' time. This card's going to be like six, 700k. If his player of the month's going for that much, that, oh, just going to go up even more. I hope I've put some knowledge in your guys' head here. You're not falling for the player of the month trap like everyone else does. If you guys are new, make sure to subscribe, like the video, and I'll see you guys later on. <laughs>